What is up? In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to build the Roger Young from Starship Troopers. This build is recommended to be built at your settlement landing pad as most of the pieces will be available there. However, you'll need a few pieces from the Demo Shipyards, New Homestead, and Hopetown Ship Technicians. If you're new to the channel, be sure to stick around to the end where I'll be showcasing the final version of the build. If you want to see more themed spaceship designs, consider subscribing to the channel because I got more on the way. So with that said, let's get to it. Alright, so first up, we're going to be placing our landing bay. This is going to be the 120LD landing bay by Deimos. Once that's placed, we're going to take a 2 by one Stroud Eklund hab piece, and we're going to place that directly over the landing bay. From here, I'm going to take a Hope Tech Nose B piece. That's just going to get attached right to the front of the, the 2 by one And then I'm going to take another 2 by one and that's going to snap right behind the first 2 by one from here, I'm going to take these Deimos Wing A pieces, and these are going to get snapped right along the side of the first 2x1. And then I'm going to take Deimos Wing C pieces, and these are going to get snapped in the first snapping point on both sides of the uh, of this second 2x1. From here, I'm going to, I have these Caravel V104 cargo holds. These are going to get snapped right to the sides of the back snapping point of the second 2x1. Then I'm going to take another... Uh, Stroud Eklund 2x1. That's going to get snapped right behind this other one. And I'm going to take these Deimos bumper pieces and they're going to get snapped right along the side of the of this 2x1. Here I have a SGD 2300 grav drive. That's just going to get snapped right behind this 2x1 right here. And then I got these Deimos wing C pieces that are going to get snapped right along the sides of this grav drive. I also have this ion beam H1030 reactor. I think this one might be available in new, either New Homestead or Hope Town, but this is going to be a Class B reactor. That's just going to get snapped right along uh, the backside of this, this grav drive. And then I'm going to take the Deimos Wing E pieces, and uh, I ended up rotating them so like the curve is kind of facing uh, back towards the, the back of the ship, but those are just going to get snapped right along the sides of this reactor piece. I'm then going to take a 100 cm ballast cargo hold, and that's going to get snapped right behind this reactor piece. All right, so now jumping to the bottom of the ship, got a 320 CB landing gear by Deimos, and this this landing gear is available only at the the Deimos shipyards. But we're going to take that, and we're going to snap that right behind our landing bay. And then got a 110 DP docker bottom piece. That's going to snap right behind our landing gear. I'm going to take the Dagama 1010 shielded cargos, and those are going to get snapped on both sides of our docker piece. I then have the NG20 landing gear. This is from Nova Galactic, so you're going to have to get this from New Homestead. It's a, it's a specialized landing gear. That's going to get placed right behind our docker piece. Got the 20T uh, hauler cargo hold. And once again, I think this one's also available in New Homestead. Uh, that's just going to get snapped right behind this first landing gear. Then going to take another NG20 landing gear. That's going to get snapped right behind our cargo hold. I got a Deimos Hall A piece. That's just going to get snapped right there, right behind our landing gear. Going to take a Hope Tech Nose B piece. That's going to get snapped right along the uh, the back side of this Deimos Hall piece. And then I'm going to be taking Eku Lander 11 landing gear. And those are going to get snapped right along the sides of this Deimos Hall A piece. And I also got the, the Hope Tech Nose B pieces that I'm just going to snap right to the front of, uh, of these landing pieces. Now I also got the SAE 5660 engines. These are going to get snapped right along the back side of, uh, of these landing pieces. And once again, I want to say that these are also available in either Hope Town or, or New Homestead. Uh, I'm then going to take the Deimos Wing E pieces. And these are going to get snapped along the sides of, uh, of the engine and landing pieces, just like that. I'm then going to take these Stroud engine bracers. And these are going to get snapped on top of the, of the landing gear pieces on both sides. All right, I'm just going to move this over here. Now moving on to the next layer. I'm going to start off with a Demo Spine F piece, and this this piece is going to get placed right uh, right here. It's going to be the second snapping point of our first uh, Stroud Eklund two by one half piece. I'm then going to take this is a Stroud nose cap B piece. Let me move the gun off of it real quick. 
And I want to snap it here, but in order to get to snap, we're going to have to actually glitch it with the other piece. So in order to do that, you're going to want to place this Stroud nose cap B piece just kind of off to the side for a split second. You're going to deselect it. Then you're going to select it and you're going to want to snap it here. But it, right now it's showing red, so you're, it's not allowing you to actually place it. So in order to place it, you're going to have to rotate it once and then rotate it again. And then you're going to cancel out of it. And it's actually going to snap right to where we need it to, to be. So in order to actually lock it in place, you're going to select it again. And now it's showing green and then you just place it so at that point we've successfully merged both pieces and then i'm going to take this ke 31a auto cannon and i'm just going to place it right back where i had it it's going to be right at the front of the stroud nose cap b piece i then got the nova thruster arrays those are just going to get snapped along the sides of this nose cap piece and then going to take a hope tech or it's going to be the hope tech pipes a piece that's going to get snapped right behind this nose cap piece, followed up with a Stroud Eklund 3x1 piece right behind that. And then going to take the M30 Ulysses HE3 tank, and these are going to get snapped to uh, the first snapping point along this 3x1. Then going to place the Damo Swing E pieces on both sides. And I actually have these Infiltrator SC02 missile launchers that I've, that I've uh, connected to both of these Damo Swing pieces. And then from here, I have the Caravel V102 cargo holds. Those are just going to get snapped in the last snapping point of this 3x1. I'm going to follow up with a Demo Spine E piece with a Warden SG400 shield generator on top of it. And those are going to get snapped right above the grav drive. And then I'm going to take the Demo Spine C piece, and that's going to get snapped right above the reactor piece. All right, now from here, we be taking the Deimos Hall A pieces, and these are going to get snapped right on top of the Stroud engine bracers. Then going to place the Hope Tech nose pieces right in front of these Deimos Hall pieces. And I got more SAE 5660 engines, and those are going to get snapped right behind the Hall pieces. And then from here, we got more Deimos Wing E pieces, and these are going to get snapped along the sides of the engine and Hall pieces, just like that. All right, we don't have too much further to go. Uh, we're going to be taking a Demo Spine A piece, and this is going to get connected right above this Demo Spine F piece. It's going to go right there. I'm then going to take this is a Demo Spine C piece, and I have another uh, gun turret on this one. This is going to be a KE42 cannon turret. I just snapped it to the first snappy point on this spine piece. From here, I've got the Demo Spine B piece that's going to get connected directly behind this one. Then I got a Hope Tech one by one piece, and that's going to get snapped right behind that. And I got uh, Horizon weapon mounts that I'm going to snap along the sides of this one by one. And then I got a Deimos one by one that's going to go right above that. And I'm going to connect the Deimos wing E pieces on both sides of this one by one. And then last but not least, I got the bridge, which unfortunately I wanted to actually place the bridge where it actually is on the ship, but I couldn't figure out a way. To where the bridge actually looked good so i had to kind of opt into placing this right here so i know it's i know this is not where the bridge actually goes to in the actual build but to make the ship look as close as i could that, that's where i had to put it but uh this is going to be the overseer 400 bridge by hope tech so this bridge will be available in hope town but uh once you place the bridge that's going to complete the build